Brent Tully is another hometown boy who got a chance to don a Pete's jersey. As for how he got his start in hockey, it's pretty much your typical story of a young kid on a frozen pond, a story almost every hockey player has to tell. Well, I, I think hockey was in my family. My father was uh, a player for, for most of his uh, childhood, and, and uh, it started on Shimong Lake, like a lot of other local kids here in Peterborough. And, and uh, just the, the, the fun of the game and, and the interest that was within my family, I think, is where it all started. It's clear those cold days spent out on Shimong Lake worked for Brent as he was chosen to play and eventually captain the Peterborough Peets. And just like any player who got to play for them, he considers himself very fortunate. Well, incredible, and I think you know to this day when I come into the rink to watch a game, it's 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 a bit of a pipe dream that 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 happened, and, and uh, you know I think it was exciting for me to have been drafted by Peterborough. It was a great privilege, um, you know, growing up watching the team and. And, and not really thinking that, you know, it was a great chance when there were 16 teams in the league that you'd be drafted to your hometown team, and, and it happened. And, and uh, you know, I had a great support system within from Jeff Tui and Dick Todd and all the great players that I had the opportunity to play with here. And, and like you said, to have been one of the captains, again, was just kind of icing on the cake for me, and, and it was a great privilege all around. Tully won the OHL Humanitarian Award in his final season of junior. An award that he says you don't go out to achieve, but an award that is very humbling to receive. I can remember talking about when I accepted that award, that, that that's the type of award you don't necessarily strive to win, but it's, it's great recognition and, and I think um, that particular season uh, that I, I won that award, I, I didn't get to play a lot due to injuries, but um, I, I would have done as much as I could anyway. And I think. That was just one of the, the, the benefits and one of the great memories of having played the game that you always want to, to help out in any way and, and to see the smiles on young kids' faces when you simply sign an autograph or, or speak to them. Um, it's, it's tough for a lot of people to, to know what that feels like and, and it's just a, an opportunity and a privilege that we can do that. Being part of the Peets and helping the community goes hand in hand when you're part of that organization. Winning the Humanitarian Award back in 1994 was just a step for Tully as he went on to chair the Easter Seals Power Play for Kids. I was, was fortunate to be involved with the Power Play for Kids uh, for Easter Seals uh, for a number of years. And, and it, again, it, it was one of those things that, you know, based on my work, has have to play the game and, and, and being able to now maybe be a bit of a leader uh, now that you're not a player and, and, and showing people that you know, that it's a genuine interest and that you always want to, to help out in any way that you can. And I think uh, there's a lot of great people in, in our own community here doing a ton of great things. And, and I feel like I'm doing just a little bit of that. But, uh, you know, it's, it's great to help out in any way possible. Well, Brent Tully never played a game in the National Hockey League. He did play in the AHL for a few seasons before heading overseas to play in Europe. Tully considers playing at any high level a privilege in itself. You know, just having had the privilege to play the game at a junior level was, you know, had it ended there, it would have been uh, great, you know, an exciting experience. And being able to play professionally, um, you know, again, it wasn't the NHL career that I had originally envisioned, but uh, all in all, I think all you can do is pull the positives from that. And, and being able to play in the American Hockey League with some great players, uh, being able to have traveled overseas to Germany for five years and, and got to see a lot of the world that people may never get to see. Um, you know, you just have to reflect and, and, and enjoy the opportunity that I was given. Playing for your country is a chance that not many people get. Brent Tully not only played for his country during the World Juniors twice, but he won a gold medal doing it in 1993 and in 1994. Tully was captain his second year says it's an experience he'll never forget. You know, the second year to have been able to be captain of the team um, and voted by my teammates to, to do that is, is, is incredible. And, and I just, uh, you know, the, the, the feeling every year it comes on television, uh, you know, my buddies and family are always, geez, you were a part of that. And, and uh, it's probably, you know, 10 to 15 years later that that kind of thing sinks in. That, wow, what an experience it really was. And, and to have won, um, you know, it's just a, a privilege to put on the Canadian jersey anytime. And, and then that icing on the cake was certainly winning gold medals.